to the crack. I'm bringing you Crayola Paint Maker, Pink Edition. We're gonna have some fun making paint today. This set is pretty much similar to the regular Paint Maker, but I've been getting a lot of requests to make more paint, so I decided to make it with this set. I hope you guys enjoy it. Let's open it up. Here are the paint pots. It looks like this has the base paint, paintbrush, and a few clips. Here are the instructions. And all of this is the base of the set. Assembling this set is really easy. We first have to attach each clip on the sides of the paint maker. Once you have two clipped onto one side, you can attach one of the two trays. I'll attach the utility tray here. And the paint pot palette tray will go here. If you guys are familiar with this set, what I really love about this is that you can fold up each side of the tray, clip on the handle, and take it anywhere you like. You can be a traveling painter. Also, we got a bunch of paint pots, so we won't be running out of paint soon. Let me put the empty paint pots into the palette. Let's see, it looks like we could hold 2, 4, 6, 8, 15 pots. Here's the base paint. This is very important. Once you remove the ceiling cap, screw the nozzle cap onto the bottle. You can hold this in the utility tray. These are the Crayola color strips. We'll be putting these in the base paint to make different colors. We get three different color strips to work with. Red, yellow, and blue. There's a clear plastic door in the utility tray. Just open that up and you can place each color into one of the sections. We can also snap in our paintbrush right here. Are you guys ready to make some colors? Let's grab an empty paint pot and begin. We'll need to start off at the utility tray. Pour in the base paint all the way up to the fill line. If you guys have seen or played with Crayola sets, I'm sure you know how this color chart works. To make this color, we'll need three red and two blue. So I'll peel off three red strips. And peel off two blue strips. Now we could put all the strips into the paint pot. You can use your paintbrush to make it easier to push it in. Tightly seal your cap and place it onto the paint shaker. Be sure to lock it by moving it to the right a little bit. 
and then you turn it clockwise. That's so awesome! The paint shaking process is my favorite! Let's take a closer look at the paint! Ooh, look at that color! I think it came out a little lighter than the color chart, but it still looks pretty good! This set also comes with labels to name our paint. I'll keep it simple and call it purple. Like I asked in the other paint maker video, if you have a better color name, just let me know. Time to try out the paint. Nice! I'm liking this purple color. What do you guys think? Let's make another one! This time I'll do an all yellow one, so I only need 5 strips of yellow. Time for my favorite part of the set! This doesn't get old! Whoa! That's a beautiful yellow color! Let's give it a try! This one works really well too! These colors sort of give off a pastel vibe, so I really like it! Time to make another one! This time I'll go for this green. We'll need three blue and two yellow. How beautiful! I'll call this lime green. Ooh, I really like this color. Do you guys agree?
All right, I'll make one more. Let's go with this one. Two yellow and three red. Ooh, this is a good orange. Let's see how it looks on paper. Do you guys have a creative name for this one? Making paint with this Crayola set's always a good time. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to watch more. See you soon. I just want to say thank you for being so awesome and following me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. And if you guys haven't done so already, the links are in the description box below.